Hi guys, so um, I've not done a video in a little while, um, so apologies. I've actually been starting my exercise routine for the summer, yay! <laughs> so um, I've not been actually up for doing videos, but I'm going to try and do them a little bit more um, regularly. So anyway, today I'm actually going to my friend's for the weekend. Um, she's having a party tonight, well, her auntie is. Um, so I thought I'd show you the sort of the travel bag that I'll take to hers. Um, I've already packed my toothbrush in my main bag, but this is the sort of the makeup slash face care slash, you know, bits and pieces that I'm taking to hers. This is the um, Disaster Designs bag um, by Paper Planes. Um, you will have seen this if you saw my Christmas haul. Um, so anyway, in no particular order, I'm just going to dig in right there and see what comes out. Um, I've got the Skindinavia setting spray. Now this is rather large to take with me but I find that it sets my makeup really well um, and I've just got this. I made a review on this at some point but yeah so I'm taking that with me. Um, hairbrush obviously. <laughs> Need to brush my hair. Oh by the way I've got my hair like this today and um, just scrunched up. Um, one it is actually really hot outside but two um, I'm gonna curl my hair later so I'm just um, making it a little bit wavy before I start so it'll curl more easily tonight so that's why I look like I've got no hair today <laughs> um some some standard eyelash curlers I actually need to get some more I actually um purchased uh the Laura Mercier little eyelash curlers and they're rubbish I can't get on with them so I need to purchase some more but for now these are just like maybe from the pound shop or something um my Naked Urban Decay palette. Some, this is where I keep my brushes in this little Vaseline lips bag. Um, I'm not actually taking that many brushes with me, but um, I've got my MAC 129, the little one, um, for just for general um, powder over my face. Um, the Bourjois. I think this is called a powder brush but um, I use it um, for bronze and sort of on my neck under my chin area if my foundation doesn't match. Um, my foundation brush it's the MAC 190 it's a little set that I got for Christmas um, and in that as well the 226 which is sort of a just saw my mum through the window there she's looking at me filming lovely um, and that's just sort of a blending brush for eyeshadow. Um, I've got my Benefit Get Bent Liner brush. This is an amazing, amazing brush for um, gel eyeliner. And then I've just got this random purple set, which I don't know where they're from, but my mum got them for Christmas. And then on the left there, this one, is um, just for my eyebrows when I do my Benefit browsings and just a little one for maybe the inner corner or today I used it under my eye um under my eyelashes so yeah that's just the brushes that I've got um I'm not actually taking that many I'm doing quite well actually um then I've got my MZ Minion um fruity moisturizer to liven up oily skin now I always use this under makeup and I'm actually getting really low but I have bought another pot so I'm just going to take that I think that'll last me for the weekend um, and along with that I've got the simple kind skin hydrating light moisturizer I find that on my dry areas I do this works a lot better and I'm still at the window um, my benefit browsings just open that up for you in case you want to see just to do my eyebrows um, simple kind skin moisturizing facial wash moisturizing facial wash sorry um I normally have a lot better skincare than just this but for travel purposes I feel just washing my face with this will be fine just for the end of the weekend she's actually cleaning my window <laughs> so she might actually be in the video um this is in no order at all it's so random I'm sorry for that Bourjois Paris bronzing powder Delice Soleil chocolate one love this smells divine um my Shiseido sun protection liquid foundation now I'm taking this and I've also got the little sponge that I've not yet used but I thought I might use it um, I'm taking this mainly because it is really sunny and I feel that it will protect my skin a little bit having said that I am wearing it today and it is slightly too 
sort of dark for my skin slash yellowy toned so I do have to apply bronzer and kind of carefully apply it so it does take a little bit more work but I thought you know if I wanted something that would be good in the sun then this might be it so I'm taking that with me although I may not end up using it I might use my Max Factor Ageless Elixir 2 in 1 foundation and serum in warm almond because this shade is pretty good for my skin um, and this is probably just easier for if I'm doing my makeup really quickly so I'm taking that if I want to do quick makeup um, my Topshop blush in Neon Rose and basically I've just discovered this and I'm really loving the formula it's sort of it it's really bright but it rubs in really well um, it goes on cream and then automatically it rubs into a powder it's just amazing you can't even see that now that's how well it rubs in it's really quite sheer but obviously it's buildable so I'm loving that next I've got false lash effect bold volume for 24 hours mascara it's the new max factor mascara now you if you see my videos before you'll know that the false lash effect mascara is my favorite by max factor however i did try this for the first time this morning i'm actually wearing it now um it does quite a good job actually but it is rather runny compared to the previous formulas like the purple one and then the original black so i don't know if i quite like this one as much as the others but i'm just gonna go ahead and use it anyway uh well i've got quite a lot actually in here uh, my MAC Black Track Fluid Line for my gel eyeliner, if I do my eyeliner like that for the party tonight. Um, Boing Concealer in shade number one. Now this is a little bit light now for my skin, but I normally just use it for under my eyes. I find that brightens them up and sometimes under my brow bones, it's really good for that. But the concealer that I'm actually using at the minute is the MAC Studio Finish Concealer and I'm NW20. This is like really cute little part and um, it's a really good concealer. Uh, a Vaseline um, lip care thing, because you need one of those. Um, Pore Professional by Benefit, just for filling in pores before your foundation. I find this really nice actually, I've been using this a little bit recently. Um, a NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk. Um, I recently got this and I've actually... Um, put it along my waterline today I'm not sure how I'm feeling about it but um, also it's good for inner corner to brighten that area up uh, Urban Decay eyeshadow primer potion now I do love this stuff and it does really work but I often forget to wear it and I've not actually got any on today so hopefully I'll use that tonight if I do eyeshadow um, Urban Decay 24-7 glide on eye pencil in perversion the ultimate black and it's amazing top shop lipstick in oh i don't know if it's got a shade maybe hedonist but anyway it's the orange one and as I, my dress is orange i will be wearing that tonight um i'll quickly show you my dress actually this is my dress it is a collar I'm liking the collars at the minute and it's quite short and it has a little belt at the front that you tie into a bow and it's just really nice and really summery and really bright and I'm really liking the orange at the minute so put that down there for a minute um, so anyway a few last things sexy mother pucker in pink apricots because this is a really good colour to put over the top of my lipstick my all-time favourite lipstick ever, Creme Brulee, um, Revlon Lip Butter, absolutely love this stuff. Um, my MAC Prep and Prime Transparent fin Finishing Powder, wow that's a mouthful. I have to keep it in the box by the way because it goes everywhere in the bag if not. I don't know, it's a bit of a crap design if you ask me. Yeah, MAC sort it out. Um, and then last but not least is the Simple Kind of Skin Vital vital vitamin night cream now i may do a review on this at some point but all i can say for now is amazing so that is everything in my bag obviously i've got a bigger bag with clothes and things 
um, but for makeup and skin wise and everything like that that is what I'm taking so um, yeah I'm taking quite a bit but um, you never know what you're gonna need at somebody else's house which is an issue but things like shower gel and shampoo um, she has those things anyway so it's cool but they're the things I'm taking anyway um, thank you to all my subscribers as always uh, if you would like to subscribe then please click here um, and if you've got any video requests on what you might like to see I might want to do um, what's in my makeup bag or something like that because um, it's a little bit different to what's in my travel bag or if you want to see skincare products I use or anything like that if anything you want to know feel free to comment below and I'll try and get back to you thank you for watching bye